This episode is rated M for market, as in stock market, because we going to get money, get paid. $349,000. Wow. I am $200,000 short. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to more Stephen Plays Grand Theft Auto V. I've been looking over some of the comments uh, over the past few videos, and you guys suggested buying the Los Santos Custom Shop out here in the middle of the desert. Well, I don't have enough money to do it, but your reasoning is pretty good. Free repairs, free upgrades, free etc. It seems like a worthwhile investment. The problem is I don't have enough money. I need to get some money. Where am I going to get $200,000? Well, to be honest, I'm probably not. There's probably no way for me to get that kind of cash that quickly, but... The Lester missions. The Lester assassination missions. Those are going to be a ticket to some money. Basically, all of the Lester assassination missions involve uh, the stock market. Grandma got tired of waiting. Uh, involve the stock market in some way. You can invest money into whatever Lester says to invest in. You perform an assassination, and the market changes in your favor. If I dump all of my money into whatever stock I'm told to, things could work out in my favor. Admittedly, I'm probably not going to get $200,000, but it would be a good start into being able to afford the custom shop. Also, I'm completely aware that you guys have told me in the past, don't do the, mi the missions until the end of the game, because then you have more money to invest. Yeah, I get that. But I need the money now. Not to mention, at the end of the game, why would I even need the money? I will have beaten the game. Let's go see Lester. What the crap is this? Hello? Hey! Hey, stop! Can I get a ride, bro? You don't look dangerous at all, Jesus Christ. How's it going, buddy? I like your uh, bandana around your head. Out of the car now! Oh! Okay, let's uh let's not have that happen. How did I not trust you? How did I know that you would be a convict? Also, I have like completely destroyed your head. Man. Alright, back to Lester. Took a while and I had to switch a car, but I am finally here. And there's a phone call waiting. Let's close this and not get hit by a car, hopefully. Alright, Lester, let's chat. Ever heard of Jackson Skinner? He's head of product development at Facade. Man, we must read different magazines. And the bastard made a fortune selling customer data to the highest bidder from Moscow to Tehran. He's handing it to the cyber terrorists on a fucking silver platter. Okay, dog, chill. Shit, chill. I got you, man. What's the play? I'm reliably informed that he has a weakness for working girls. There's a regular he likes to pick up in La Puerta. You stake her out, and she should lead you to Skinner. I'll send you the location. Meanwhile, maybe I'll take another look at the fruit share price. <laughs> All right, homie. I'll be in touch. Cool. Done and done. So what we need to do, besides watching prostitutes, which is one of my favorite activities, we need to learn the stock market. Money and services. Ball sack, dynasty, fleece, uh, ball sack. Okay. So, markets. Fruit, 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 fruit. Alright, so it's uh, selling for 383 So we want to buy fruit. <laughs> because it's going up, man. It's going up. Also, look, it, it was down. So it's going up. So let's buy. And how much of this can we buy? Probably a lot. Can I just hold this? I can just hold this. Okay, we have $140,000. I plan to dump all of it into fruit. It's a lot of fruit. But I'm, I'm buying. And there we go. 36,235 shares of fruit. Boom. Done. We have three... <laughs> we have three dollars. Okay. And then we'll just exit out of here. Alright. Now, supposedly, we are going to go do this mission and fruit's stock price is going to go up as a result. When it does, we will sell our share. And yes, once again, I'm totally aware that you should, I guess, do this at the end of the game because then you would have more money to put into it. And maybe we won't do all the Lester missions. Maybe we'll save some until we have more money. But for someone who needs money, this is a good way to get it. So 
hopefully this is going to pay off a bit. I actually, I'm really fond of how they did everything in GTA 5, adding the stock market, adding huge value properties, because one of the problems in some of the past GTA titles is that, especially near the end of the game, you have so much freaking money and you just have nothing to spend it on. A lot of times you don't need to buy weapons because you, you get weapons by, you know, just participating in missions. They either give you one, give you weapons for free or you get them from killing people, so it's, it's kind of nice that they give you something to actually spend that money on and something to, you know, reach for. Damn, that must be my girl. Hi there, beautiful. You want to party with me? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. Watch for the vehicle that she enters and kill the driver. Okay, I probably shouldn't, like, be right there. I'm just going to park on the sidewalk like a normal individual. Don't mind me. Oh, I could probably kill him before they even leave. Let me get out of the car. That'd be easier. Don't mind me, I'm just... Hey, what up, just girl? your average... Not today, honey. Young gentleman Whatever. crouching behind a fancy I'm stolen out. car watching prostitutes. There we go. I should really get a silencer for this thing. I could afford it. They're probably not going to give it to me. So I just need to wait, and hopefully she will very shortly get into somebody's car, and they get popped. Maybe it's this guy. Although, if this is like the head programmer or whatever for a big company, it's kind of weird that they'd be driving that hey, car. Baby, what can I get for ten bucks? You can get the bus home and jerk off thinking about me. Get the fuck out of here. Ten bucks? Come on, man. You know better than that. They start at 50. Don't ask me how I know. That's kind of a nice car. Hey, baby. That's the guy. You miss me? You know, I don't even feel bad about it. <laughs> that was really easy. Wow. Holy crap. A lot of the other assassination missions have been difficult. That was just like, bam, son, you got popped. I wonder if I pull him out of the car if he'll have any money. Right, let me just jump over here. Get out of the car. And also, I might be taking your car. I don't know how I feel about that yet. He had 83 bucks on him. Now I have 86 bucks. But this car kind of sucks, so I'm just going to ditch it and take the car I had. Oh, fart! I didn't leave the area. Now I'm wanted. Okay, let that be a lesson to you, children. Leave the area. When you, when you commit a crime, you're supposed to leave the area. And ran over your face. Okay, so now I'm going to have to escape the police. Crap. Maybe I would have gotten stars regardless of if I would have left the area, but definitely probably didn't help that I didn't leave the area. Ugh. But I'm cool. I could actually stop in at that custom shop because I'm right next to it, but if I just stay on the bridge for a bit here, things will pro. Okay, let's go the other way. There's a cop behind me. There's a cop behind me. I might be able to ditch them if I can get away from this cop and also possibly get off the bridge. Is there a way to get off the... Yeah, right here. This is my stop! Is that the water? Well, that's one way to escape the police. Okay, I'm good. I'm gonna miss that car, but I'm good. Just need the police to stay off of me for a sec. Okay, that would have been nice to have. Okay, careful, careful, careful. Don't let them see you. I did it! I should be getting a call from Lester. Right on time. Hey, man, I'll wipe that software for you. Ah, excellent news. I'll speak to you soon. Sweet. Mission passed. Bam. Vice assassination. Clean escape bonus. Yeah, I didn't get that. Um, <laughs> probably because I sat around and didn't get out of there. But, you know, lesson learned. Also, hey... Besides the fact that I'm stranded until someone with a, another jet ski rides by. Um, which actually could happen. I should keep my eyes and ears peeled. Let's see if that has affected the stock price. I don't know if it's going to happen that fast. If they're going to know that he's dead that fast. I should be able to use my portfolio. Up 21%. Is that it? <laughs> I mean, I'm going to make 30000 bucks, which is cool. But that seems kind of low, right? Is the market still open? Or is that a thing in GTA 5? Is the market's only open until, like, what, 4? It's 8 in the morning. It could change, right? Maybe I should just give it a little more time. It, it might go up a little bit more, because that's not a huge return. Now I have a boat. 
Okay, I might be in trouble, though. Okay, you guys need to get out of here. Go swimming. They're fine. They're going to be fine. And now I have a way to get out of here. Let's see, can I get up on this boat? I'm going to be in trouble with the freaking boat police in a minute. Excuse me, homie. And off you go. <laughs> All right. Easy, uh, easy enough. Those people make it out. Are they good? Where did they go? Did they drown? Because I don't see them now. Either that or they're really fast swimmers and they're already safe. Okay. Now I have a way to get out of here. I finally figured out how to get the ball sack to come back, which is a phrase I thought I would never actually use. Um, apparently you have to be connected to Xbox Live to actually use ball sack. So I reconnected to ball sack, or I mean <laughs> reconnected to Xbox Live, and my ball sack came back. Good. Um, this never got any higher. In fact, I actually slept at my house a few times, which uh, if you save your game, you don't have to actually ac actually save. Just activate the save and then return, and it moves time forward, I think, eight hours. I did that a few times thinking that the market would be affected in some way, and it wasn't. So, maybe I don't understand how the market works in the game. Maybe it's not actually based on individual game. Maybe it's a... I don't know, maybe it's in everyone's game? I have no idea how it works. But, it doesn't look like it's actually going to go any higher than 21%. To be fair, that's still pretty good. I'm going to make 30,000 bucks. I just was under the impression I would have made more. Alright, this will return... blah 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 blah. Confirm. Alright, so now I have more money than I had, and I mean, that's good, um, but, uh, I guess I'm not gonna make enough to buy the Los Santos Customs place, which is a little sad, but it's okay. Alright, now what we need to do is get the, how do I get that, there we go, uh, we need to find something else to do. We could continue doing Lester missions, but to be fair, I'd rather earn money another way. Uh, we can go see Devin and get that last car, which actually seems like a pretty good idea, or we can go see Michael. I vote we see Devin. Devin has been promising to pay us. If I'm not mistaken, he wanted five cars, and we have brought him... I think we've brought him four of them at this point. Another turn chop? Oh, I gotta school your ass. One day I'll hang out with my dog. One day. All right, let's go see Devin. All righty, Devin. Let's have us a little chat. After we call Molly. Hey, Molly. I'm outside the studio. All right. Go over the wall and find the car on the lot. And then what? Only the principal actors and stunt people are authorized to go near it. So, you could get in wardrobe and play the part or try something else. All right. When you're out of there and clear of studio security, call me. So, I could actually dress up, which is pretty sweet. I'm in. Find the actor. Um, what, how, how could I dress up? Because I have to find the actor and hit him or something. But, uh, this isn't, it, this isn't actually exceedingly clear to me what yeah, I'm supposed I to I, do. I think I get it? Uh, no, no, no cards. What's uh, going on over here? got any, uh, rock cocaine? After that take, I really need some. <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? Again! Reset. Are they actually going to play out of the and scene? I, I love the extra dialogue. Apparently it's a silent film. Okay, well, I need to find... Let's see. Is yours? Oh, they are going to act. Of other people's businesses. And that's it. Okay, let's see if we can find... I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go hit... I'm, I'm assuming since it's a red icon, they want me to just go, like, beat the actor up. But I would like to get into wardrobe. I don't know if that's a possibility. I don't know how many times I have to tell you I'm allergic. Do you understand? Do you understand? Now listen to me. Just get the Oh, you can knock out the actor to get his clothes. That's what they want. What's up, bro? Gotcha. Haha. Okay, cool. I was wondering how that worked. So now I get to be the actor. Is anyone going to question that? Maybe not. Man, I look sharp. God, I hope we get to keep these clothes. 
I'm just gonna play the rest of the game as sharp dressed Franklin. All right, get in the car. Don't mind me. I'm uh, I'm here to play a role. You need to get on set. Where I'm, on my, I'm on my Brandon? way. Jesus, are you gonna find him? Someone's gonna find him. Hey, I'm right here. Does anyone know who this guy is? Is this the new stun guy? At least get him a mask or makeup or something. Security! <laughs> car. Excuse me, away from the car. Get that guy out of there. He's not signed Okay, off. they seem upset. Man, I'm sorry. Get out of oh, they're gonna shoot at me. Oh, I got a woman with me. Doing? Oh, you're just gonna stick with me. Oh my God, you hit him. Yeah, that happens sometimes. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh, these are good. These are good oh missions. Oh my God, this is an abduction. A little bit. Pull over, creepo. God, she's grabbing the wheel. The wheel. I need to get the fuck out of here. Studio security are shutting your ass down, wacko. Oh my god. They ain't gonna be on us for long. She keeps grabbing the wheel and it makes it very hard to steer. Alright, I... Is this an abduction? Nah, you cool? No, I'm not cool. Not at all. I You're mean, fine. chill out. I'm just interested in the whip. This button says spikes. What do you mean, the whip? Yeah, <laughs> What do you mean, the whip? I could buy this car with what I make in a morning. I think you underestimating the value of this automobile. Or overestimating your own talent. Uh, I think you're underestimating what I get paid. You get paid a couple million for a morning's work? Shit, I should sack my agent. Yeah, shit. Stockholm Syndrome won't work on me, fuckball. Look, I respect... God. I respect you as an artist and a human being, but I got other priorities. Stop this car now! Jesus, I've woman! I've been abducted by a crazed fan! Girl, please! Oh, that's what's up! I like some of your work, but don't get ahead of yourself! <laughs> what's wrong with you? Didn't your parents love you when you were a child? My dad disappeared. My mom was a crackhead. But that ain't what this about. God damn, what's this button do? <laughs> Shit! Whoops. If you have the car, bring it to Hayes Auto in South LS. Mr. Weston is marathon training, but he can reconfigure his route to meet you there. All right, cool. I got the car. No drama. That's good. The studio is enough of a money sink without the costs that that drama can bring. What kind of shape is the car in? We plan on refitting the guns to take live ammunition. Do the traffic spikes and ejector seat need replacing, too? Uh, both of those are going to need replacing, all right? Good. One more thing. Mr. Weston's security detail are concerned about a suspicious <laughs> figure near the garage. Let us know if you see something. Oh, that poor girl. Also, ejector seats, folks. Ejector seats. Spikes and ejector seats. Do I have more spikes? Just gonna test this out. Yes, I do. Do I have infinite spikes or something? Dear God, this is amazing. Grenade, sticky bomb, unarmed. Let's go back to unarmed. Man, okay. I, I don't know if the game is going to let me, but they better freaking let me have ejector seats in cars. And then just have people ride along with me and then eject them out of the car because that is freaking amazing. Now we just have to go back to the garage. There's apparently a person of interest there that they are worried about. And I might have to kill them or something. Could just be Trevor. <laughs> Maybe Trevor like grew a beard or something. Actually, that's one thing that I was interested in doing. I, I was I have been reading the comments, and some of the people uh, that have been commenting were interested in seeing some changes to the characters, basically playing dress up, which I'm totally cool with. Um, I don't like changing them up extremely, but I think it's fun to put them in new stuff. So I think I might do that. Um, actually, part of the Los Santos customs thing and, and the reason I wanted to do that is for changing up the cars because you can mod the cars if you mod their personal vehicles they stay that way and if you have free modifications then we could mod them quite often which would be pretty sweet so that's one of the reasons I want to buy that thing but yeah I'm totally I'm totally cool with the idea of uh, of driving through all of these fences no I'm okay I'm cool with the idea of changing up my clothes and stuff all right let's open this thing up so who's outside? I'm not sure what they're talking about. <laughs> You're developing quite the rep there, Slick. Oh, Insurance Devin. companies hate these kinds of claims. They don't like cats with the inside edge. Shorten them either. 
So how'd it go? Smooth enough, you know. Movie people. You know what the irony is? I'm a major shareholder in that same studio, so we just did is practically legal. Ha! Practically. Ooh, shit! Look at this motherfucker. You doing it big, my nigga, on the set. Lamar, what the fuck are you doing here? Oh, chirped your boy Trevor. It's fucked up when you gotta get your GPS location on your homeboys through a motherfucking speed freak. True that. Devin Weston, master of the two-hour female orgasm. What it is, Holmes? Lamar Davies. He was just leaving. Hey, not on my account. You looking for gainful employment, homie? Hell yeah, I'm always trying to get some motherfucking paper. Just the type of guy I like to work with. Predictable. Hey, we could bring your boy here in on the last part of the shipment. Oh, yeah, nigga, that's exactly what you could do. That's exactly <laughs> Hell what you yeah. could do right man, there, yeah, man. Exactly. If you want him in, then you get him to boost the rest of the shit you got. Oh. Give me my money and I can go on oh, with my motherfucking oh, life. Oh, no, am I sense intention here, Slick? <gasps> He's the spirit, but you're the brains. Am I wrong? I can see it. Look, I need you on point when we move this stuff out of town. Yeah, whatever, man. Call me when it's done. And after this, make sure we got our motherfucking check, all right? Ciao, baby. It is what it is. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, come here. I'm gonna put you in touch with my legal counsel. Hey, hey, don't touch me, homie. I don't get out like that. Yeah, let me tell you how the world works, Slim. <laughs> Mission passed. Needs to get that going for me. Bam! Deep inside. Fastest speed. 89%. Should I have been going faster? A, a premature ejector. So basically, I, I got a bonus for as soon as it came up on my screen, what does this button do? I hit it. Probably if I would have waited, she would have been like, wait, no, that's the ejector seat, bro, don't hit that, please, oh god, I will die. But I didn't wait, man. I heard that there was a button to hit, I hit it. I was excited. Hey, babe. Hey. Hey. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, next episode, I don't know, I, I guess we're going to go see Michael. I, I feel kind of bad because we've been leaving Cletus hanging. Cletus has been up here just chilling, waiting for Trevor to go see him. It's going to happen, Cletus. Give it some time. I think next episode, though, we're going to go see Michael, see what's up with that. We're going to wait on the Lester mission, wait till we have a little bit more money. I'm excited. It's hard to tell what's going to go down. Last we heard, Trevor had abducted uh, Martin Madrazo's wife. It's probably related to that. It's probably going to be pretty great. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time for more Steven Plays Grand Theft Auto 5. That woman just walked in there and the door opened for her. And then walked out. Okay. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Listen. Beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And that, you know, can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. Might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined then. <laughs>